Hello Scorpio and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a great day today. So let's see what's going on around you in love, what spirit wants you to know. Just take what resonates, leave the rest behind. Somebody's been talking to somebody else about you, okay? And they're being told something they didn't want to hear. Um, yeah... I'm getting the sense that you're trying to keep something a secret, maybe, or they think maybe that you're trying to keep something hidden. Um, and that's wish fulfillment, okay? Maybe you um, have met somebody new. Some of you could be even starting a family. Um, some of you could be purchasing a home, uh, maybe even making a house move. Some kind of wish fulfillment has happened for you here. And this person... Um, I don't know. They, they're they getting secret information from somebody in your inner circle, okay? Or this could be something like somebody coming to talk to them and them not telling the truth, hiding where you are maybe, or hiding what you're doing. What is this tower? I just feel like somebody's kind of stressed out and falling apart here. They heard something they didn't want to hear, I feel. They're having a tower moment here because maybe you're getting wish fulfillment here. Ten of Pentacles, Ten of Cups, they're finding this out. Because um, the Knight of Swords is the one delivering the truth. So, um, yeah... I feel like they're finding something out about your wish fulfillment. Got earthy, yeah, and they pushed away an earth angel. Oof. That's the tower. They're just now realizing this. Oh, they're just now realizing who you are. Yeah, look. Ooh, and they know they missed out on an earth angel. They're finding out the truth here from someone in your inner circle and the way they're it's almost as if they're finding out that you've got the ten of cups and the ten of pentacles okay this is what they're finding out and this information was hidden from them like they had a chance at an earth angel and it would you would have brought them to this ultimate wish fulfillment and they had no idea who you are Okay, they had no idea. It was hidden from them. They realize here that they missed a blessing in love with you. They literally could have had it all. And this person's just now finding this out. It was hidden from them. They may feel even a bit betrayed here because they didn't know earlier. But this was a test. This person wasn't supposed to know who you were. I feel like they were being tested. Okay, um, I feel like this is somebody who pushed you away, mistreated you horribly. And they had no idea that you were an earth angel that was going to that was going to acquire um, with ultimate wish fulfillment. The ten of pentacles, the ten of cups. Somebody is cluing them in on this. They're giving them. It's almost like it's not like they're coming to this person saying, "Hey, you screwed up with an earth angel." No, no. They're coming in with confirmation that, you know what, um, you were a dream for this person. You were like the answer to their prayers, and they had no idea. I feel like this person highly underestimated you. They may have even treated you like you were nothing. And it's like, this is confirmation. The, the things that you're doing and accomplishing out here, you couldn't be doing without divine help and intervention. You couldn't be doing this and, and accomplishing and acquiring this unless you're spiritually led. And that's confirmation for this person. They had an earth angel and it was like hidden right under their nose. And they underestimated you. They pushed you away. They treated you like crap. They paid attention to everyone else except for this blessing. Okay, everything and everyone else was a priority and you, they pushed away and you are the earth angel. And this is their confirmation here. Somebody's giving them the information. They realize too, um, if they've been getting their karma tower moment, um, it's because of how they treated you. 
and they lost everything. This is having everything in life that you could possibly dream of having. Okay, ultimate happiness, wish fulfillment, happy family, happy home, generational wealth here. Generational wealth. Oh my gosh. Yeah, they're just, this is like a confirmation for this person. They're just seeing this now. All right, so, um, yeah. And they're feeling pretty stupid. They're kind of pouty about it. Yep, and you're about to get somebody new here. Oh man, this person feels like a fool. They're literally just seeing this. And they can't sleep over it. Look at this. Everything that they're being told, everything, they're putting it all the pieces together here is what they're doing. They're putting all the pieces together behind the scenes. Maybe things that you said to them, mentioned to them, um, things that you've done, things that you've shown them, the, the um, information they're getting from this Knight of Swords energy, it's all, all the pieces are falling into place and they're like, what, what? I missed out on an earth angel. I missed out on all of this. I was being tested and that's why I'm feeling all of this defeat in my life. That's why my foundation is crumbling. This is also a sudden realization here. I'm telling you. <laughs> yeah, and I feel like you're about to get new love or this could have been them, right? This could have, they could have, they could be in the six of wands energy right now having a victory with you being held in high regard with you right man all right so yeah and you're blocking them out because this person broke your heart they put you in a third party they uh they sacrificed you they sacrificed you for everybody else, and the one that stands out above everybody else is now you. They didn't see it before. It was a test, I'm telling you. Twin flame soulmate connection here. And the choice that they made, they were tempted away from you, maybe. I get the sense that this person is mad. They could be an emperor at your side. They're realizing you're their divine being. They're realizing you're their, their divine counterpart here and an earth angel energy. They're realizing all of, the, all of the puzzle pieces are falling into place for this person just now. And they feel like an idiot because they had a blessing. They caused you nothing but strife, chaos, a lot of fighting maybe in the background. This person could be fighting with other people too in the background about this. Um, I get the sense that they're upset. They're mad. They're angry. They're, they, they're crying here. They're realizing. Thank you. They're realizing what they've done and how badly they screwed up. And everything that they lost. They're just now seeing this, you guys. You could be dealing with the Pisces, Aries, Virgo, Taurus, maybe a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Gemini. You could be a Sagittarius, Cancer, um, Gemini. They could have caused some kind of competition here between you and other people. I feel like there's a whole community here that went up against you possibly blamed you, sent you bad energy, just maybe just wanted to fight with you. This person did all of this. They're realizing they did all of this to an earth angel when they could have had everything. Yeah, you're the empress here. Oh my gosh. Yeah, they're seeing this clearly now. You're the divine feminine. And they could have been the emperor at your side. Yeah, yep, they're seeing it now. They're seeing it now. They're praying to have you back. They're praying for another chance. Look, a reunitement here. This is also a twin flame soulmate card. Yeah, this person's about to come forward here. They know you're their wish fulfillment. 
look at and they know with you if you were to accept this offer this love offer this apology they could have the ten of cups with you all look they know they know you're their divine counterpart here oh my gosh this person feels like a complete fool they're seeing this clearly it's almost like they're looking into their future now what could have been with you and now they don't want to let you go they may even feel a bit intimidated by you now actually i can see this um four of pentacles as intimidation okay um maybe a little bit of fear because they know they 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 want to make this approach look at this man they don't want to let you go they know you're the divine counterpart soulmate connection here oh my gosh thinking back on how you were with this person they're realizing all of this you didn't deserve the way you got treated they were an idiot for not not seeing the truth until now I feel like you're out of their life here, okay? And they're just seeing as you move forward and get the Ten of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles, possibly new love here. Um, they're putting all the puzzle pieces together. And it may be too late for your person, but they're coming forward here. They want to be the emperor at the empress's side, man. They want this, they want to restart, they want to redo, they want this cup here this ace of cups that's this cup here that the divine tried to give them they want this back they want it back you know look they see you as the one here you could be a taurus virgo capricorn honestly for collective readings you guys you can be any sign okay this it's really just energy okay we we really just call out the signs for you as like a confirmation an extra confirmation okay but yeah this person's coming in to get you to calmer waters man they're figuring this stuff out with the hermit they're figuring this out or you could be in hermit energy not wanting to deal with the situation anymore you you're busy <laughs> You're a busy, busy person, divine feminine energy. You're rocking it out, um, acquiring the Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. This takes a lot of responsibility here, right? So, yeah, take it how it resonates with you, but oof. You were like the third party here. This person saw you as the third party. They put you through it. You've had your name, your reputation, your heart, your love, everything dragged through the mud. And now you're taking control of your own life. Yeah, this person there, they've been afraid to confront you. I feel like they fear you. They do now because they know how badly they treated you, collective. Okay? You're taking control of your own life here. You're taking your power back. And you're looking forward into your future. You've got drive, determination, enthusiasm. You're feisty. Yeah, you you are. Um, you're in your North Node here. In your Ten of Cups and your Ten of Pentacles, it's almost as if you're you know you're both holding on to like what it is that you want you're holding on to happiness and a future out of um coming out of like a, a battlefield right and they're holding on to the hope of you you're having a new beginning here and they want a new beginning with you but they treated you like a third party they sacrificed you man They want to get you to calmer water so bad. This person, I feel like they're about to come in and make you a big love offer apology, okay? Please forgive me. You're my wish fulfillment. Yeah, they were given to other people here, and they left you sitting here empty-handed, and they knew it. They knew that you were waiting to hear from them. They knew that they had broken your heart. They knew that you needed justice, and they ignored you. 
they focused on everybody else but the earth angel. Okay? They don't even know if you're going to give them the time of day or not. Clarify this King of Swords. You could be dealing with the Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. That could be your energy here with the King of Swords. Because this person, I feel like they're about to approach you. Or someone else is feeding them information about you. I've got the King of the Queen of Cups on the bottom of the deck. Um, very you're very loving, very intuitive. Ooh, and you're yeah having a new beginning here. Um, this wants to come out too. This could be somebody who may need to travel towards you. They could have had, um, they could have had other people with them, right? This person could have been in maybe a commitment with someone else who is also getting cut out. Um, I feel like someone else is watching you here. This person wants a new beginning. They may have to walk away from a Queen of Swords energy to come towards um, their empress here. And if that's the case, this queen of swords knows it. She wants the truth. She knows this person wants a new beginning with you. She knows that they're coming to you with an offer. Can we start over so they can build this ten of pentacles? Okay? So this person may be in the process of breaking up with someone um, in order to come towards you, maybe that's what they're afraid to do. Because this Queen of Swords, she looks, she's angry. She knows what this person is about to do. And she just wants to hear it, you know. She wants a confrontation. Um, these two could have been together for up to six or seven years. So possibly a long-term relationship. But this masculine, I feel like they want to come towards their empress. They realize now what they missed out on. Now it's kind of like they're scrambling. Okay. <laughs> yeah, very burdened here. This person doesn't want to be with this Queen of Swords anymore. Okay. They hate going home. They're burdened by all of this, especially now that they know what they missed out on. They don't want to go home to um, a cold Queen of Swords. No, they don't. They want to come towards you. Strength. You could be a Leo, Virgo. Um, I've got Virgo here. I, but yeah, they want to go towards the one who has been on her own, silent, standing in her strength, her boundaries, her, her truth, and having integrity. That's where they want to go. They want to go to their empress. Divine feminine. Now that this person knows exactly who they are, they're a divine masculine. They should have been building at your side. Oh my gosh. I'm telling you guys. Yeah, they're seeing everything clearly now. All the illusions are down. This is something they can't seem to forget. They're never going to forget this. Now that they know the truth, how can they, you know... Oh, man. Yeah, it's it's about to be over. Something's about to be over here. I feel like this person, yeah, they're manifesting their true soulmate. It's time. I'm telling you, they're manifesting you back in. <laughs> this is a very exciting reading for me. I'm sorry. <laughs> but yes, um, this is now, you, you guys, I don't know. Um, for those of you who've known me for a long time, You'll know, I've mentioned this before. I, for one, see this as a Divine Masculine card because they are such strong manifestors, okay? And they've always had all the tools they need at their disposal to be strong and stand up for themselves and get what they want, okay? This I'm seeing as a Divine Masculine card. I'm seeing this as a Divine Soulmate connection. Um, and this person is trying to manifest you back, their soulmate, their true soulmate, because it is time. The universe says it's time. This is the universe. The wheel is turning here. 
I feel like they're ending something. They're leaving this uh, karmic situation behind to come towards their true divine feminine, divine masculine. Take it how it resonates. It's not gender specific, okay? Um, I'm just seeing, I'm seeing both of you out on this board. Yeah, you know this person's get. you know, you know they're about to take action and come towards you. I cannot make this up. You guys, you could be dealing with um, a Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, right? I've got um, Virgo, Aries, Scorpio out here. Uh, yeah, the high priestess held in very high regard. Uh, you're held in high regard by the divine, but this person didn't hold you in high regard until now, okay? But yeah, extremely intuitive. You're very tapped in and you can feel this person approaching you, man. It's like they're right by the side of your head, <laughs> right? You can feel this. You may even be able to pick up on their thoughts. You may be able to pick up on, on the things that they're saying. The closer they get, I feel like the more in tune you get with this. Um, you're not speaking to this person either. You've been absolutely silent. But they're about to um, they're about to come forward and talk. Okay, you're, this is where they take action. All right, um, and it could be any sign. The Empress is is could be any sign in the deck uh, in the zodiac. The um, the Emperor could be any sign in the zodiac. Really, they take on the energy of all four kings, all four queens. Okay. So yeah, you're about to get this. Um, you're about to get this talk, right? This masculine's coming forward. They're ending things with the karmic. They're going to be telling them the, tr the truth. Um, and this masculine is now trying to manifest you back in. They realize who they are. Okay. <laughs> so get ready, collective. Really, really awesome read. Um, whether you want this person back or not, right? I feel like the choice is going to be yours, Divine Feminine. Whoever was left behind, the choice is going to be yours now, okay? Um, so get ready for this communication. It's happening, all right? 